Alrighty, hey guys, what's up? It's me, Priscilla. So for today's Inktober, the word on Jake Parker's list was mysterious. Now, I know there are a ton of mysterious characters, but I wanted to pick my favorite mysterious busters, which happen to be Dipper and Mabel Pines from Gravity Falls. I have always loved this show and I can't believe it took me so long to finally watch it. And I binge watched it on Hulu. If you have not seen Gravity Falls yet, get a Hulu subscription and watch all of it. I love this show and I'm pretty sure next to Tina Belcher from Bob's Burgers, Mabel Pines is my spirit cartoon. <laughs> she is literally me. I am Mabel. And I'm also Tina Belcher, but I am absolutely Mabel. Everything she does, it's just like, oh my gosh. I love every single one of her sweaters, and I love the way she acts, and I love Dipper a lot. I just, I, I adored this cartoon just because it had a storyline, as opposed to all the different cartoons that are out now. There's like barely any storylines in cartoons anymore, but Gravity Falls had a storyline that you had to... You didn't have to keep up with every single episode, but it had a storyline that, like, it had things that would make sense if you watched every single episode in chronological order. But I love it. I just absolutely love it. And I wish that Alex Hirsch would make a season three. But I heard that they're continuing in, like, books instead, like comic books in a way, which is totally fine with me. And I'll read every single one. I am so excited for it. I need it. I need more. I need more Gravity Falls. I just, I, I need so much more. I want them to come back for another summer. And I want there to be, like, a whole other adventure. And I'm totally looking forward to it. For another story, um, I'm actually going to Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party for the first time in my life on my birthday that I explained a couple videos ago and it offers you to dress up as somebody so I bought a whole Mabel Pines ensemble and then I got she wears sweaters if you if you don't wear a sweater it doesn't really make sense with Mabel Pines if you don't wear the sweater with the skirt it doesn't make sense you just look ridiculous so I bought a sweater and then I checked out the weather and then I saw that it's going to be 80 degrees with like 50% humidity the night that I'm going on the 19th at Magic Kingdom. And I went, yep, sorry Mabel, this isn't gonna happen. But I'm so sad that I, didn't, I don't get to wear all my Mabel costume that I put together. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a bit of a sad thing, but hey, at least I have a Mabel Pine sweater now and I can wear it through Christmas time and the winter days just because it is so hot right now. It doesn't even feel like fall, so I'll get around to wearing Mabel's sweater once in a while. Yes, guys, I hope you enjoyed this and look how beautiful this blue ink is. I'm so happy that I chose it because I wanted it I wanted it to be like opposite like I wanted them to be the only black and white in the photo and the background is that shiny blue. Ugh, I love the pearlescent ink so much. But yes, guys, I hope you have a most wonderful day and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye!